Hey what's up guys I'm at here. So today we have the Lexus with X27 smartwatch which comes with many amazing features inside it under $15. In this video we're gonna be checking out all of its features but before we start if you're new here a subscribe to the channel will be highly appreciated. So let's get right into it and explore everything in the Lexus with X27 smartwatch. So first of all inside the box we get the user manual then we have the smartwatch connection guide a USB A magnetic charger and in the end we have the Lexus Fit X27 smartwatch So here is the first look on the smartwatch we have a 1.46 inches display and if you use the torch application then here is a look at the bezel size the screen resolution is set to be 360 into 360 we have one button on the body it can be used to turn off the display and to turn it back on and it can also be used as a back key and after that we get the magnetic charging points and the health sensors here and it is using 22 millimeters removable straps and you can easily remove them and use any 22 millimeter straps with it and here's how it looks on the wrist what do you think about it let me know in the comment section below after that if you take a look at the ui and first of all we have the control center split screen quick access applications and the notifications on the home screen then you can access the menu by swiping twice on the left side here is the menu you can also go to settings and display and choose the other menu style it comes with many other menu styles inside it and you can choose whichever one suits your style i prefer to go with the list view because it is easy to use and all of the applications have their name next to the icon then it also comes with several watch faces inside it there are seven built-in watch faces inside it so you can also install additional watch face from the gallery or the dial market for that you can use the fit application so here we have the watch faces so as you can see here we have seven built-in watch faces and you can edit this one with your own picture from the gallery for that click on edit and you can tap here to choose a picture from the gallery and after choosing the picture you can tap on done other than that you can also create watch faces using ai so first you will have to click a picture so that it can copy the pattern after that select the object and tap on generate and here it has created different wallpapers using the pattern so after choosing your desired one tap on generate and then you can customize that watch face other than that it also has many other wallpapers available about customization you can customize the position of the clock and you can choose what is shown above the time and what is shown below the time in the end you can also change the font color after that we also have the dial market the dial market also has a lot of watch faces designed according to the circular dial and all of the watch faces in it are available for totally free if you talk about the screen time then in display we have the sleep option with a maximum timer of 30 seconds so the display can stay on for 30 seconds and after 30 seconds of inactivity it will turn off as it does not come with the always on display or the screen of dial option talking about the gesture it comes with the raise to wake gesture to turn on the display and to turn it back off using the watch application you can also receive notifications directly on it it also comes with the others option which means even if an application is enlisted here it can still send you the notifications for it when you receive a new notification it vibrates and when you turn on the display it shows a full screen prompt and you can also scroll a bit in the notification and here's how the notification center looks like here we have the incoming call notifications and it also comes with bluetooth calling inside it you need to go to settings and then go to phone call and here enable the phone option so you can also receive call notifications directly on it and it also shows the name of the caller without syncing the contacts after accepting the call we have the option to transfer the call to the smartphone and back to the smartwatch from here then we have the mute and the sound adjustment option and you can hang up the call from here not just receive calls you can also dial calls directly from it but as of now the call will fail for me as my iphone 11 does not have a sim card inside it not just that using bluetooth calling you can also access the voice assistant directly on it how's the weather today expect some clear skies today daytime temperatures will hover around 35 degrees with overnight lows around 26 and the volume is clear and loud enough to be heard properly after that you might have noticed the media audio option in the phone call so when it is enabled if you use the music application to control the media playing on the device it will shift the sound to the smartwatch if you do not want it go to settings and go to phone call and turn off media audio after that you can control the media playing on the device and the sound will continue to play on the smartphone and it's a great thing to have both of the options in the smartwatch other than that we also have the find device option and the find phone option 
then we also have the world clock application so you can add the countries you want here and after that those countries will start to show up in the smartphone and also add multiple countries here then you can swipe to check the time of the other countries you can also use the smartwatch as a bluetooth shutter button and click pictures directly using it you can also save a qr code in the smartwatch it also has the favorite contacts option by which you can sync up to eight commonly used contacts in the smartwatch in the end we have the others option where you can set the time format the unit format and we also have the languages supported by the smartwatch let's take a look at them Then you can also push weather updates to the smartwatch. You can either turn on the location services or choose the location manually from here. It also shows the sunset and sunrise time and also the weather for the upcoming days. And then we have some health related options. You can also find the health data in the home tab and the application can also connect with Apple Health as well as the Strava application. And now it is time to take a look at the rest of the applications. First of all, we have the activity application which stores your steps data. So I'm back after testing the pedometer and I have to say that I'm quite impressed by it considering its price. The pedometer is working quite well. I took around 37 to 38 steps roughly in the room and I was holding the smartwatch still in my hands during this whole time which means the steps recorded was not based on my hand movement. According to that, the results are quite accurate. After that, we have the heart rate, blood pressure and blood oxygen level checker. Then we also get the stress checker. And if you use them with the straps at the back, the sensors are continuing to work, but then they have stopped and it has given the error wear the watch properly and try again. So it is quite impressive to see that in this price range, it is also offering wear detection. So I'm gonna test it with my fingers at the back and I'm also gonna check my pulse manually. So I've counted 15 pulses in 10 seconds which should equal around 90 beats per minute and according to that it is showing quite accurate values so overall considering the price of the smartwatch i'm quite impressed by it it also comes with a sleep tracker and since it has weird detection so it should work fine after that we get a lot of sport modes here you can also tap on this icon if you want to customize the time and calories target or you can start without any target first it will run a timer and then it will start the sport mode but unfortunately it does not allow you to control the media playing on the device while doing the workout exercise record stores all of your exercise data then we have the relaxation or breath training here it helps you to focus on your breath we also have timer with some predefined times and you can also tap on custom to set time according to your need and when the timer ends it starts to vibrate several times and it vibrates about five times then we also have stopwatch here you can also tap here to start it and tap here to add as many laps as you want you can also add alarms directly in the smartwatch so let's set the alarm you can also choose the days if you want to repeat it now let's wait for it to ring here's how the alarm is shown it rings as well as vibrates and here we have the close and the snooze option we also have the cycle tracking application for the females. You can set up your profile in the application if you want to keep the record. In the end, we get the calculator, which has the basic functionalities like multiplication, division, subtraction, and addition. But if we try the percentage function, then it is working fine with the multiplication option. But if you use it with addition, then it doesn't work fine. And in the end, it comes with one game inside it, which is the 2048 game. And these were all of the applications in the X27 smartwatch. In the end, it is advertised to come with a battery capacity of 230 mAh. It can be charged using the magnetic charger provided in the box. If I talk about my personal experience, then I've been working on this video for about 20 to 25 minutes now, in which it has lost only 4% of the battery. And considering its battery size, it's quite impressive. And in my opinion, with normal usage, it can give you 3 to 5 days of battery life. So guys, this will be all from today's video and from the Lexus Fit X27 smartwatch. In my opinion, this smartwatch is totally worth $15. If you would like to place an order, I'm gonna be leaving its link in the description box below. And I would really appreciate if you can use that link to purchase the smartwatch. So make sure to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. I will catch you in the next one. Until next time, this is iMat. Peace.